The most important aspect to focus on when it comes to losing weight and getting lean and losing your belly fat so you can have some definition is calories in versus calories out. But none of those calories will even matter. Really, nothing will matter if you're not getting enough water in. 80% of America is dehydrated, meaning if you were to go outside right now, leave your house, and just do a full 360 look around, then out of every 10 people you see, eight of them are literally dehydrated. What happens if you are dehydrated? Obviously, that means you are not drinking enough water. You're not drinking the water that your body needs. In return, your body will reduce its metabolism. Your metabolism is how many calories you burn when you're at rest, meaning you're making it harder on yourself to lose the weight. Also, you will massively reduce your performance in all aspects of life, not just in the gym, but also in your office, in the bed, in any aspect of life as you can imagine. Also, when you are dehydrated, you are more likely to have bigger cravings, to have more hunger. Drinking water is just, it's, you, if you don't drink enough water, you're gonna get cracked skin. Look, here's the deal. If I just tell you that if you don't drink enough water that you're gonna get cracked skin, then you, as a mom, you probably are like, ooh, wouldn't wanna have that. But here's the real deal. If you don't drink enough water, you are literally shaving off 10 years of your life that you could have been with your kids living an awesome life, being an awesome role model to them. Because if you do not drink enough water, you are asking for your body to just swell up, inflame all your internal organs, your vital organs are not gonna be properly nourished because water is the transportation mechanism. Water is the, the horse that your nutrients ride on their way to wherever they need to be. It's the FedEx truck that brings, if you eat, let's say, some protein, it brings the protein to the muscle. Water is essential. If you are in a desert, stranded, you already know the question, you've heard this many times, what would you rather have? A little bit of food or a little bit of water? Water is what you need because water makes you survive. If you right now are not drinking enough water, then you are literally going to die a very slow death. You are asking for problems. Now I know what you're thinking, how much water should you drink? I recommend just shooting for a gallon. Do you really need a gallon? Not necessarily, you can have a little bit less, but if you shoot for a gallon, then by shooting for the stars, you're going to at least aim high and you, you, at least you won't land in the mud. Let's put it that way. So shoot for a gallon and you might hit 0 0.8, 0 0.9 gallons per day. That's gonna be a whole lot more than what you're drinking right now. How do you do that? You treat your water intake the exact same way as you treat everything else that you do daily. What do you do when you wake up? Well, first off, when you wake up, you are at zero steps. You are at zero water intake. You are at zero of everything. Now, if you know that you need to get a gallon in every single day, hit your water intake hard when you wake up. So here's what you do. You wake up in the morning and you right away, you take five sips of water. That's like the first thing you do after you stand up. Then maybe go use the restroom or something like that. Come back to your water, drink another five sips. Then what I like to do after the initial 10 sips, sips, then I'll do like some shoulder mobility movements. I'll just do like a empty hand shoulder press just to get my shoulders flowing. I'll do some hamstring stretches. I'll do some squats, just some basic mobility morning gymnastics. Nothing crazy, like nothing that you would wanna see on video. Then I'll take another five sips. Now I'm already 15 sips in. Then after those 15 sips, I'll walk to my kitchen, I'll unplug my phone, turn my phone on, whatever I'm doing, and then I'll take another five sips. Now you're already 20 sips in. Your body was dehydrated when you woke up. Your body was a Sahara Desert. Now you're 20 sips in, now you have momentum. When you have that momentum, then you will hit a gallon. But if you wake up and you're not drinking water, you're not at a half a gallon, before 11 a.m. or noon, then you're never gonna hit it. So it's all about how you start your day. And if you wanna get one of those bottles that has like, be here by 10 a.m., be here by noon, be here by 2 p.m., 
you can do that, but really, this, you, you, you just have to drink water. I mean, don't be a, don't be a wuss.